What is going on guys? It's Ben here coming at you late night with a Clash Royale video. Sadly, no update news to report today, uh, but we do have the touchdown challenge. And I'm having, having a tough time. We have a giant chest to open up here too. Nothing crazy out of here. But I've been having a tough time trying to get nine wins on the touchdown challenge. I don't know what it is. Uh, maybe I'm just bad at touchdown after not playing it after so long. But we're going to try and turn that around. Try and get nine wins here. I thought it was going to be a little bit easier than this. And you can see we are struggling. We're seven and two. So hopefully we can do well. Uh, I'm just very curious. You guys need to let me down below. Do you guys like the touchdown mode? Or do you hate it? I think like the community is split. I think, I think it's a combination of two things. I think A, the people that like it are also very sad because they do not see it that often. And then also, I think there's this group of people that, since we don't see it that often, they, they don't mind the game mode, but they just hate the game mode because we didn't, we, like, it just is associated with that update as well. Like, you guys remember it was, like, the biggest update ever, and we got to play Touchdown, that was about it. That's how they were, like, portraying it, and then a lot of people were mad about that. So, I don't think, I just think Touchdown gets a bad rap because of that update. Like, that, this was what was going to be in the update, and we only got to play it for, like, a weekend or something like that. So... I don't know. What do you generally just the game mode itself? Not its past, what it was tied to with updates or anything. How do you guys like touchdown mode? Do you hate it? Do you like it? Do you think it's good to change? Do you like it's a nice change of pace? Do you just get frustrated with it? I do get frustrated with it, but I do enjoy it. I think it's a good change of pace from just like the normal matchmaking ladder. Um, if that makes any sense. They have two super big pushes going in there. Big heavy hitters. Trying to save my princess here. Just did save her. Well, this is a no-go. This lava on's gonna get through. Dang it, man. It's a tough start. They have big, big cards. They got the good cards, though, dude. They have... The Lava Hound and the Giant, or the, not the Giant, the, the Lava Hound and the Golem. Those are the cards you kind of want. I'm going to throw down a... Oh, dude. Play defense over here. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. That was like, I haven't seen a Rocket Miz that bad. I can understand maybe... Maybe if he whiffed it, like, by, like, an inch or so... Like, you just kind of missed the shadow. But that was like a total, a total misclick with the thumb there. Wow, that gave us some life here. <laughs> oh, jeez. Honestly, my battle deck is trash. Like, I have no good cards. The only, like, solid one that I have is the balloon. Which is iffy. Come on, Expo. We ain't losing to this Lava Hound today, boys and girls. Heck no. See what their play is. Oh, this would be a perfect lightning. Too late. Come on, Barbarian Barrel. The Barbarian Barrel isn't in here. That's right. I uh, wrongly said the Skeleton Barrel. <laughs> But my, if I would have kept adding enough elixir for that lightning, that probably would have won us that game. Just saying. Oh, so that one's on me. He whipped on the rocket again. We still cannot win.
Come on! Let's get it! <laughs> Jeez, dude, it's hard for been quiet, too. Ooh, ooh, executioner! Executioner! Executioner, let's go! <laughs> oh, good game. Jeez, if that guy did not whiff on those those rockets, we would have been in trouble. So now we're eight and two. Sorry if I went a little silent there at times, but man, I was trying to make plays. What, really? I thought we were going to lose, like after the fact, after I missed that lightning, or I didn't miss it, but I should have did it earlier, like I, I, I second back guessed myself, I shouldn't have done that. So we're 8-2, having troubles all day. On my level, on my Benson 1 new account, my level 11 account, I think the highest wins I got was like 6. Mm, I'll take the log, they have the princess. Come on, this is it. It's for nine wins here. Honestly, nine wins ain't all that much, but ah, uh, this is a tough choice. The the Dark Prince is amazing in this because he's a he's he's fast, but the Inferno Dragon is going to shred our Mega Knight. But we do have a Night Witch. I'm gonna take the Inferno Dragon. Plus, if we do face something heavy, I do have that in my back pocket as well. See how this works. Ooh, they gave me a battle ram. Battle ram is probably the best card now that Hog Rider is no longer well. It's no longer in here. Once again, the lava hound. Okay, we're gonna drop our archers. Take care of these. Um. I guess Musketeer for the Electro Wizard and that Executioner too. We have the Dark Goblin for support as well. I'm kind of happy I took the Inferno Dragon. It's going to shred that Lava Hound. I don't know if they have a Zap or not. I don't think they do. Inferno Dragon, still alive and kicking. Sadly, not for long. Oh, he's got that Mega Knight. Okay. I got you, bro. Don't worry. <coughs> Flying machine. Interesting. So I'm gonna do Inferno Dragon this Pekka. The Electro Wizard. Uh, and you can't really kite. Can't really drag the Pekka with the Ice Golem nowadays. Well, because it's not a regular match. The P.E.K.K.A for sure, what do you have, Phantom? Do you have anything? Uh, I'm gonna have to log the Electro Wizard. Oh, the Third Goblin might take care of it. Clutch Freeze. That was close. What's guilty? Oh my god! Oh, he was, he, he passed the goal and he broke the plane. Come on. This ain't the real NFL up in here. As soon as you break the plane, you win. We've had some close matches today, though, guys. For real. Like, if you check out my Twitter, that one was actually not the closest match I've had today. Nice. Perfect lightning. So close. Come on, bat. Oh. oh, the freeze. The freeze. Come on. Come on, bats. You want it. You need it. Oh, why'd they poison? That was a waste of three elixir. The bat still got it. Oh, here we go. We getting these nine wins? This is sad. Like, it's only nine wins. I, I felt the same way on the... I'm the last Reddit blind deck challenge. It was only a nine win challenge. But I, I had the most fun trying to win it, dude. Oh my gosh. The struggle is over. We had some very well plays there from Phantom. And shout out to Phantom today. Or anyone in the clan who was playing, who was playing a lot with me. Feels good to be great.
Best day of my life. <laughs> oh, we're getting nine wins in the touchdown. But yeah, shout out to Phantom for helping me out throughout the, uh, the touchdown matches. And I think Spider Freak I played with a lot today as well. Just the clan. Clan mates helped me out through today. Nine wins, we got it. It was tough, man. I'm not gonna lie. It sucks when you when you draft and you don't have like a for a touchdown, you don't have like a good card or a win condition, and you get a bunch of crappy cards. Sadly, no legendary out of here. That's fine. We just enjoy it. I honestly, I like touchdown. I think it's a nice change of pace. Like I had a lot of fun playing it today, and because I remember it came, didn't it come for the April Fools? I believe it did, but I didn't play it on April Fools because I, I was busy that entire day. So it's been my first time playing touchdown in a very long time. Um, so I was happy for it. Uh, I, I personally enjoy it when it comes around. I think it's it's pretty fun. Uh, you can see we got Valet 46 here with 115. We still got a long ways to go though for the clan chest, but whew, not bad. Now I kind of want to do a regular ladder match. Probably probably suck now at regular ladder matches because of the because of just playing touchdown. It's like two different. It's two different play styles, dude. Into the first match, going up against. Nova Japan Can't really read his name. This is level 12. That's because we're kind of I think we're I, I'm pretty sure we're fairly low in trophies for the time we are in the season so To be expected Probably gonna suck after playing touchdown We'll see here I'm just gonna cycle my zap so I can get to my elixir collector. See if we can get a response out of the mans. We can. So it's probably a golem as well. Or Pekka. I'm going to say golem. Or that. That works too. He's going to get some decent damage, but I'm going to push on this. He's got his Dark Prince. Guys, I think the Dark Prince is probably going to receive a nerf in the next balance changes. Probably balances changes are going to come when the whenever the update does come. We got the tower. No big deal there. Uh, we'll just pump up. We have a lead. I wouldn't feel confident pushing with the golem because i probably get obliterated by a by a giant, which is gonna happen anyways. Got the prince, dude. Just trying to save my prince for as long as I can. Because if you tornado it back, it doesn't hit your prince. And then it helped out because we took care of his giant in the meantime. And we're still pumped up. And we're about to hit double elixir. So we're about to hit our stride. Haven't lost a tower. <clears throat> Here we go. He's gonna push my left hand side for sure. I think I made a fatal error. Jeez, that ice spirit, man. Shredded my toe. Or not shredded me, it stunned me so bad. That's alright. Not the end of the world just yet. As long as we don't get three crowned here, we still have a very massive push he has to deal with. Probably get fireballed here. <clears throat> You can get that Dark Prince there. I'm just gonna start my next push. Get this going. I'm gonna zap his Prince. And Tornado is onto the Tower Star Baby Dragon, get some hits, and then there we go, that's all she wrote. So, even if he was level 12, or I mean level 13. I think we had the, the matchup on him. Sorry guys, <clears throat> had to drink some water. Sound like I'll need coffee tack, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Won the touchdown challenge, that was awesome. Excited about that, even though it was only, uh, what was it, a giant chest and then 20,000 gold. But hey, it was fun, I had a fun time doing it. But hope you guys enjoyed the video, subscribe if you to the channel, as soon as we get update newts, it'll be coming here first, so stay tuned. I'm excited for this update. I hope it's gonna be big. Like I said, as soon as we get news, you'll see it here. So if you enjoyed it, subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys later.